Hello and welcome back to the channel, glad to have you here. In today's video we're going to talk about two important warnings I would like you to know regarding using yarrow as a healing herb. Now previously we did talk about yarrow in all its um, forms and all its parts and what you can use it for, what it's traditionally meant for as well, as well as some simple recipes. I'll include the video um, that gives you an overview of the plant in the description box below so be sure to check it out and if you have not yet subscribed please support the channel, subscribe, I'd love to have you on board. Now the two warnings I have for you for today's video in regards to using yarrow because yarrow is a wonderful anti-inflammatory, cool, uh, sweet and astringent herb. You've got to be careful with using it and you've got to use it for the right reasons. So um, I want you to avoid using yarrow or any other plant and herb in large doses. So when it comes to yarrow specifically for pregnancy, please, please avoid using the uh, yarrow herb. Now you can use it in small doses here and there, but personally, I would avoid using yarrow during pregnancy in all its stages. Why? Because yarrow is a, her, um, a uterine stimulant. Anything that's a uterine stimulant should be avoided during pregnancy. Also another warning for you for today is that in rare cases unfortunately this wonderful plant can cause severe allergic skin rashes. And this is mainly due to the wrong uses of yarrow or even the prolonged use of the um, plant and also the prolonged use like you've been using the plant for many many continuous months every single day kind of for example can in some people uh, cause uh, the increase in the uh, skin's photosensitivity so please be careful of that these were two warnings i had for t today if you enjoyed today's content like share and subscribe i'd love to have you